Social media users are calling out mainstream outlets who didn't televise the live stream of South Africa's genocide case against Israel at the ICJ, but did televise the live stream of Israel's legal defence. Since the October 7 attacks, 113 journalists have been killed. Social media posts have been censored, government paid ads have spread misinformation, and the language used to report the war on Gaza has been... confusing. For example, why do some outlets describe these as children, whilst Palestinian children are labelled as minors or people under 18? Why were Israeli citizens named and given backstories, whilst Palestinian mothers and fathers were described as women, man or human shields? Why was the Hamas-led attack described as an attack or a massacre, whilst the carpet bombing of Gaza was described as explosions? Whatever the answers are to these questions, social media users have noticed and highlighted a difference in reporting, coverage and language concerning Israel and Palestine.